A creature from the deep that washed ashore in Ocean County, New Jersey, had people asking, what is it? I like froze in my tracks because I was not expecting like something that big. A nasty discovery washing up on the shores of Higgins Beach, the large carcass of an unknown animal found on that beach. It's in a bad state and it's very smelly and I think that it should be removed from the beach very quickly. Apart from giant lobsters, enigmatic alien creatures and majestic mammals, oceans can bring forth the most mind-boggling stuff that will make you wonder why it's not a good idea to be alone on a beach. Not everything that appears at the beach can be easily explained, and this creature is one of them. It even left the experts scratching their heads. In February 2015, an unsuspecting man visiting Wambaro Beach in Australia found this thing when he had simply gone to do some surfing. Very, very long ears. Check out that. Very long ears. Many called it a swollen up brush tailed possum, but the man inspecting the animal was not sure if that was really the case. After messing with people's minds for quite some time, they came forward with two possibilities. It was either a giant African rat in bad shape or an undiscovered species that got discovered for the first time. Juvenile Alien One of the strangest things to wash up on the beach was found on a remote beach in Florida. The skinny green body of the critter gave off a strong alien vibe. And honestly, if this is real, it has to be one of the clearest evidence I've seen of extraterrestrial beings. According to the publisher of this video, the creature was still alive when he found it and even moved its head a bit. Shit. Many believe this to be a true alien because even the government has admitted to their existence. Mutant Critter Imagine you're exploring the beach on a calm night and its serenity is shattered by the presence of this odd creature that resembles no other being discovered by humans. The horrifying face and elongated body were the perfect combination to create a real-life demon that could haunt the dreams of every viewer. Netizens had some crazy theories to identify this creature. While some were simply speechless about what they had seen, others started calling it an experiment gone wrong or a juvenile deep-sea monster. Alien Creature A simple walk with the pet dog turned into an interesting find for Erica Constantine when she encountered this enigmatic creature in Sunrise Park, South Carolina. What the heck is this? Her dog had spotted this unusual find and caught the attention of its owner to figure out what it was. Well, I actually found it, my dog River. I, I saw her picking at something like with her nose. The skeleton seemed to be missing its teeth and eyes, and the overall body shape was so bizarre that it could not be identified. Definitely wasn't a dog. I thought somebody would be like, oh, it's like, um, you know, like a, a seal, and then I'd go about my day. Some even started blaming the restricted government facilities for creating new kinds of species. The exact identity of this find has not been found yet. Could it be a normal species just in shape or an alien from the unexplored depths? It stumped a lot of people. I had no idea. I have never came across something like this. Loch Ness Monster We've all heard stories of the Loch Ness Monster. Oh my God! And despite many denying their existence, a strange creature resembling one washed up on a beach in Georgia. It had an elongated, slim body and a head, surprisingly resembling a fish. Many viewers who believed in Nessies even started calling it the best evidence of their existence. But no such claim was made by any of the experts. One of the logical explanations for this appearance could be that a fish had a genetic mutation that changed its appearance. It's kind of creepy how it took the exact form of a Loch Ness Monster. Mysterious Merman a group of fishermen were working hard at Sarogo Island to catch some fish when a mysterious odor caught their attention. After searching the area in the night, they found this creepy sea creature covered in black hair. The creature had an oddly humanoid skull and a long spine, suggesting that it could be a cross between a human and a sea animal. 
maybe a merman? Whatever the case was, no one on site could figure out what they had encountered. They just had some speculations, making it a mystery. Sea Monster A beachgoer came across this monster at Ainsworth Beach near Liverpool while taking a stroll through the beach. The reality of this ominous find kept on taking creepy turns the more it was studied by the locals and the online communities. First, this creature was impossible to identify because of its unique looks. It's obviously the remains of some animal in an advanced decomposition stage. But the question is, what animal was it? Another detail in this find was that the bones were perfectly straight. It could either be a mutated cattle dumped at the beach or just a sea animal that appeared from the undiscovered depths. Its reality, or how it arrived on the beach, remained a mystery. Killer Whales I think I have another reason for not going to the beach again. This group of friends was enjoying their time when an orca decided to prank them with a rush to the shore. By the looks of it, it had no intention of munching on them, because if it did, there would have been nothing stopping the top predator of the ocean. Orcas plan and execute stealth attacks on their prey, even on the beaches, and they're pretty good at it. See how it happened just seconds before a nice strike? These men are lucky it was just exploring some humans swimming in its water. Get out of the water! Alien jellies. A scare in the water for a tourist when she gets too close to the highly venomous Portuguese man o' war. And that tourist and her boyfriend went for an afternoon swim Friday in South Beach. Well, they ended up racing out of the water, screaming for help. No matter how much temptation you feel to touch this majestic critter, I'd suggest you stay far away from the Portuguese man o' war. A large number of these jelly like things were found washed ashore at a beach in Chigasaki. Officials had gotten the news of these stinging man o' wars and decided to clear the area for the safety of the people. These are actually multiple organisms living as one unit and are mostly found floating on the water's surface, with their tentacles hanging down to catch anything that gets caught in them. An interaction with these seemingly harmless animals causes severe pain and a lifelong memory of a bad day at the beach. All over the arms, a little bit on my torso, and I was screaming in agonizing pain. Blue Ringed Octopus Meet the Blue Ringed Octopus, a tiny but mighty sea creature with a big reputation. These little guys are famous for their dazzling blue rings that light up when they feel threatened. But don't let their small size fool you, they pack a powerful punch. If one of these octopuses ends up on the beach, you better walk the other way. They carry a venom that can take down anything. A Sydney woman is lucky to be alive after being stung twice by a blue ringed octopus. Luckily, they're usually shy and prefer to hide away. Still, if you spot one, admire its beauty from a distance and don't get close. It's a perfect example of nature's rule, look, but don't touch. Freaky animal. A beachgoer got to experience something far more bizarre than the ordinary sand and seaweed on the beach. As he was strolling through the area, he came across this unidentifiable creature staring right into his soul. This is right here. Looks like a furry tail, but look at the claws. It had creepy claws and jaws, making it look somewhat like a chupacabra. But the guesses from online viewers were a lot darker than anyone could anticipate. The fur and sharp teeth made them think that it could be a dog who got trapped in a plastic bag floating in the ocean and had no escape. This event shows how much we need to be cautious about our impact on the ocean world. Giant Whale All of these people have gathered around to witness the dark side of nature. A giant 14-meter long whale made its way to the Ipinema Beach, where swimmers were stunned to witness the sheer size of these animals in real life. The exact reason for its appearance could not be determined even by the experts. Its high level of decomposition made it hard to study. The authorities were called to the scene immediately to get samples of the whale and study the exact reason so that it could be avoided the next time. 
sea monster. Our oceans are full of mysterious depths, and sometimes they bring forward marvels that even scientists can't recognize. Such a thing happened on New Zealand beach, when people came across this creepy creature washed ashore. What is it? It's a good question. Take a look at this grizzly carcass. It was found on a New Zealand beach. It had jagged up teeth, an odd shaped head, and measured 30 feet in length. The creature did not resemble anything known to the people on site, so they naturally started making different assumptions. Some called it an experiment gone wrong, while others speculated alien invasion in our world. But the truth? It still remains unknown. What do you think this creature was? Party Pooper Who would have thought that a cobra snake could make its way to the beach as well? A bite from these serpents is enough to take down an elephant. So, watching one slithering among the sands of Hout Bay Beach must have been quite terrifying experience for these people. Out of fear, they even tried to guide the snake to some distance so that it would not hurt them. But it looked like this method agitated this cobra even more as it took a defensive stance. On another occasion, a venomous sea snake made its way to Bondi Beach, and it became quite a pain for the rescuers who were trying to get it back to the water. With proper caution, it was finally kept in a bag and taken to the rehabilitation center where it could regain its strength before going back to the wild. Colossal Claw Of all the things you might expect to discover on the seaside, a giant claw is probably not one of them. This huge crab claw messed with the mind of the person who found it. And even the viewers who witnessed it online. It definitely belonged to a giant. Some even started guessing that there might be a crab monster getting ready at the depths of the ocean. Although the species of such a crab was never confirmed, it was estimated that the claw might belong to a giant coconut crab. These are one of the largest land invertebrates and can grow up to 40 centimeters with a leg span of one meter. Strange Creature If you ever go to a beach and see something like that, just don't touch it out of curiosity. This mysterious object was found by some friends hanging out in Green Harbor Beach and they had no idea what it was. It most certainly did not look like anything normal once the beachgoers uploaded the video to the internet in hopes of getting some answers, they certainly got it and they were not very promising. People mentioned that these were the guts and gills of some fish. No one would like to touch something like that, would they? Box Jellyfish If you're planning on going to the beach, I've got a super important disclaimer for you. Oh my, uh. In addition to the beautiful waves, crabs, and starfishes, there is a chance that you will be greeted by one of these. This thing will kill you. That is a box jellyfish. Although they mostly live in the ocean, sometimes they wash up on the shores too, as a big pain for everyone. Box jellyfish are believed to be one of the most venomous ones in the world. A sting from them can cause severe pain, and in some cases make their victims meet their lord as well. So if you're enjoying your time at the beach and find one of these, then make sure you steer clear from their way and stay with your friends. A box of jellyfish, everybody, and it'll kill you. Look at those long tentacles. Red Whale Who knew that whales could also come in red? Wait, something seems off about this discovery. If you look a bit closer, you'll see that the reality is far more eerie than what it seems. This was a normal whale completely covered in thousands of lice, enjoying a tasty lunch. The incredible giant was found by some unsuspecting visitors at the Beach Point Lookout, who were not ready to encounter something so bizarre. Whale lice are ectoparasites living on the skin of some species of cestaceans and feed on the algae growing on the skin. Sometimes the lice are still alive on a freshly dead whale. They won't feed on us because they're symbiotes with the whales, um, but it's a little creepy to have them attached to your fingers. Once these tiny scavengers found a whale carcass on the shore, they had to avail the jackpot and get to work to maintain the natural balance. Giant Whale
This is exactly what happened to the fishermen of Salar Islands when they found a giant whale in the Taka Lagaman water area. They had gone out on their casual day of fishing when they came across a black object that looked like a mountain. Out of curiosity, they approached the object and it turned out to be a giant black whale. It was like these men had hit the jackpot, as it was estimated that the whale measured between 10 and 12 meters. I'm pretty sure they won't have to work for like another week. Whale Rescue Sometimes you can be at the right place in time to make a real difference. This happened at the sea off eastern China's Ningbu City when rescuers found a 20-meter-long sperm whale stranded on the sand. They tried to tow it with a boat, but its humongous size and weight made it almost impossible to get the whale back to the ocean. Even here, they did not lose hope and decided to stay by its side until nighttime when the tide would get high. Till then, they kept the whale hydrated with water and medicines. At night, the water levels rose, and the rescuers used their tugboat to get the whale back in the ocean. Giant Snake Sunbathers in France believed that they had spotted an actual titan boa on their regular day at the beach. A huge 425-foot snake skeleton appeared out of nowhere among the sand and water taking everyone's breath away. Rumors of an upcoming storm were even spread among locals who took it as a bad omen for the society. But once it caught the attention of authorities, a proper result came forward. This skeleton was actually an art piece created by Hung Young Ping, mainly made of aluminum. The exact reason for this masterpiece was not identified by anyone, but it was believed to be one of the greatest beach arts made by anyone. Unidentified skeleton. Can someone explain to me what this is? I mean, I know what it, I know it's a skeleton of some kind, but what? While many oddities get washed up on the beach, this one startled its viewers the most. Beachgoers had spotted this unusual skeleton in the sand, and with most of its parts missing, it was hard to tell who it belonged to. Considering its shape and size, many started thinking that it could be a mermaid. And honestly, considering how little we know of our oceans there could be a possibility of it belonging to one. On the other hand, it also resembled a baby whale. What do you think it was? Hairy Sea Monster The deep sea is so unexplored that it's hard to deny the possibility of real-life monsters lurking in the depths. One such creature made its way to the eastern coast of Russia. The enormous furry beast could not be identified because it had no prominent face or eyes. Another strange feature of this find was its hairy appearance. Because sea giants normally don't have that, a closer inspection showed that these were actually muscle fibers and that it was a major piece of the puzzle to solve the mystery. According to experts, this was a highly decomposed remains of an unknown species which was most probably a giant whale. There's no need to be afraid of any sea monsters. Star-studded beach. What's happened? In March 2018, beachgoers from the town of Ramsgate in the UK were disgusted to discover that their ordinary beach sand was replaced by masses of tiny starfish bodies. Once investigations were started to identify the cause of this unusual appearance, residents of the area were relieved to find out that it was just the deed of Mother Nature. It's normal for some starfish to appear on the beach as they get there while hunting for food. But this beach looked like the heavens had opened up to release a whole galaxy of stars on it. And the culprit behind this oddity was the cold temperatures caused by the winter storm. A series of storms lowered temperatures and brought snow to the UK, and the cold water caused thousands of dead starfish to wash up on the beach in Ramsgate. Known as the beast from the east, these conditions make sea animals like starfish vulnerable to being carried to the shore, hence causing mass stranding. Thousands of jellies. Lots of blue bottles. Parts of the Elkhorn Slough, California Beach, had taken up an extraordinary blue color in place of its usual brown sand, and thousands of blue bottles were to be blamed for this transformation. People visiting the area first thought it could be some sort of blanket covering the whole area. And once they got close, the truth revealed itself. Normally, these tiny critters do not appear in such big numbers, but this occurrence was out of the blue. According to experts, fast winds and warmer currents 
brought these to the shore in huge numbers. But be aware, these pretty looking critters can sting quite badly, leaving their opponents with a jolt of pain. Hundreds of Jellyfish Imagine a beach in Crimea, usually bustling with people, later taken over by a sea of jellyfish. Thousands of these squishy creatures had made the shores near Shulkin Village their new hangout. But that doesn't normally happen, right? The warmer weather and saltier seas are the culprits here thanks to climate change. While these jellyfish, mostly the arella type, won't seriously harm you, they sure can sting and feel pretty yucky to touch. The once popular summer spot got pretty empty after their takeover, leaving us humans to wonder about the changes happening in our oceans because of our activities and how they could be affecting our favorite beach getaways. Giant Squid We all know giant squids normally reside in the dark depths of our oceans and are rarely seen on the surface. But this rare sight became a real-life encounter for people visiting the beaches of Fuki Prefecture. A local fisherman who found the squid said it was the first time he found a giant squid alive. The creature measured three meters in length and surprisingly was still alive despite traveling to the surface. Officials immediately got to the scene to examine this rare occurrence and took the squid with them to study it properly. Velia Velia Thousands of tiny jellyfish-like creatures have washed ashore, pushed onto the beaches by recent strong winds. California's beaches were stormed by these vibrant blue critters, and many visiting these areas were amazed yet curious at the same time. These fascinating sea creatures were Vela Vela, often called the by-the-wind sailor. They're like nature's own sailboats, drifting gracefully on the ocean's surface. They have a clear bluish body with a small, upright sail that catches the wind, guiding them across the waves. Sometimes they end up on beaches, in large groups, creating a stunning, starry-like blanket on the sand. While they might look a bit alien, they're totally harmless to us. Deep Sea Monster Sightings of the huge deep-sea creatures, dead or alive, are unusual because they typically swim thousands of feet below the surface. But that's exactly what happened when an incredible 18-foot oarfish washed ashore in California. It took a team of 25 people just to lift this massive creature. Jasmine Santana of the Catalina Island Marine Institute made the discovery of a recently deceased oarfish on Sunday. Oarfish are like the hidden treasures of the ocean, rarely seen and shrouded in mystery. Jasmine Santana of the Catalina Island Marine Institute made this once-in-a-lifetime discovery when she was snorkeling and spotted the giant fish, then impressively swam it to the beach herself. A buzz of excitement made people rush to see this rare find, which might soon become an extraordinary skeleton display. Giant Sunfish In March 2014, visitors in John Smith's Bay, Bermuda, found a sunfish washed up on the shore. Normally, these ocean giants float in the middle of the ocean and are a rare species, so finding one on the shore was definitely one memorable sight. The creature measured 14 feet vertically and 10 feet horizontally, weighing nearly 5,000 pounds. So you can just imagine how big this find must have been. These fish are mostly solitary, and as they are mostly floating on the surface, the winds and ocean currents can carry them towards the shore human-like creature. While walking down the beach with her daughter, a woman made a surprising discovery of a fish that had human teeth. Even the upper jaw of this find looks super creepy. Now, I know it sounds too bizarre to be true, but such a species actually exists in our world. These are the sheephead fish and have evolved to take up humanoid teeth that can assist them in getting the best out of their diet. So if you ever stumble across a fish with an uncanny human smile, no need to panic. Unsolved Mystery A mysterious sea creature has washed up on the beach near Galveston. A curious and somewhat eerie sea creature had been discovered on a beach near Galveston, and the intriguing find sparked a flurry of speculation and comments among the people who shared their varied and imaginative guesses. Descriptions ranging from a giant pile of nope to comparisons with creatures from nightmares came forward. The Texas Parks and Wildlife Department, along with other experts, had been consulted to shed light on this mystery. There was even a whimsical suggestion that it might be extraterrestrial in origin. 
Further insights from authorities are still awaited as no one knows what it really was. Mysterious Blob In April 2018, a group of beachgoers discovered something far different than the ordinary shells and crabs on the coast. As they were enjoying their day on the sunny beach, they came across this unusual globster moving back and forth with the waves. Just looking at this gives me shivers! I'm surprised at how they were willing to poke around and check what it was. After some inspection, these curious people found out that these were the guts of a shark that had perished in the depths of the ocean. And only this could make it to the surface. Would you have picked something like this and checked it in detail? Mermaid Skeleton Remember how we used to fantasize about mermaids being real? This beachgoer lived our fantasies when he found a mermaid skeleton hidden among the seaweed. What is that? I don't know. Now, I know this is not like the pretty mermaids we watched in the movies, but who knows what they look like in real life? Ooh. Once the man uploaded the video to the internet to find some answers, he got mixed reviews. Some called it a prank played by his fellows, while others were convinced that this might be the remains of an actual mermaid. Do you need to touch it? What the hell? I can have cooties or something. Floating gold. The ocean is not as unforgiving as we think. Sometimes it can be pretty generous. Some explorers had come across a giant sperm whale washed up on the shore of Spain's La Palma Island. Although it sounds pretty basic, the reason behind its appearance was the real fascinating thing. Experts found out that the whale had ambergris stuck in its intestines, which became a reason for it to perish and appear at the beach. Once extracted, the precious material weighed around 21 pounds and was worth $430,000. The reason for it being so precious is its high usage in making the most expensive perfumes. Basking Shark In January 2024, the new Brighton Beach had the most uncanny surprise for its visitors. As an old person went for some jogging with hopes of enjoying the sand, he stumbled across this horrifying creature taking over all the beauty of the beach. Once the news was spread, people wanted to know about it more, but no one could understand what it was. The decomposition had made it super hard to identify its species. Amid this confusion, different conspiracy theories came forward, some calling it an underwater alien. Experts debunked every claim when they identified it to be a 15-foot-long basking shark. These are fairly uncommon in the area during the winter, so its appearance was a bit shocking to everyone. Apocalyptic Signs We all know there's sea foam in the waves, but this is something far different than ordinary foam. In December 2023, the shores of Hakodate in northern Japan turned white for miles due to thousands of lifeless fish that appeared for unknown reasons. These horrifying sights look like the starting scenes of an apocalyptic movie. Once scientists were shown these visuals, they came up with some answers. There was a possibility that these sardines were migrating south and encountered a mass of cold water, or simply appeared due to exhaustion. Still, some fish were collected as samples to run tests and gather more information on what was causing these mass strandings. A rare find. A happy day took a grim turn for the people visiting the long beach in Kalanta when they found a five-meter-long whale shark washed up on the shore. The authorities got to the beach as soon as they heard the news of the endangered animal appearing at the beach and used proper equipment to clear out the fish. Whale sharks are an endangered species, so keeping them safe is seen as an important step by locals and experts. This is why authorities stepped in to conduct proper inspections to find out what had caused such a loss. It's time for today's open discussion. A mysterious sea creature nicknamed the Baby Loch Ness Monster recently washed up on a UK beach, sparking curiosity and excitement. Imagine walking along the shore and stumbling upon this bizarre-looking creature. 
Its unusual appearance has drawn comparisons to the legendary Nessie of Scottish folklore. The discovery quickly caught the attention of locals and online communities, with people speculating about its origins and identity. A large part of our oceans is still unexplored, so there could be a chance of people's ideas being true. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again.